What's up YouTube and welcome to this edition of Kutu Old School RuneScape Guides where we're going to talk about the Brine Rat. They are combat level 70, they require 47 uh, Slayer level, they give you 50 Slayer XP, their weakness is magic, they have a melee attack style, and if you haven't completed Olaf's quest you're not going to be able to do them. So if you haven't completed it I'll put the description, uh, put a link in the description to my Olaf quest guide. Their really good drops are the Brine Saber, which is about a 1 in 512 kill uh, drop rate for about 200k. They drop a lot of raw fish, and they drop a lot of runes that are worth picking up. Uh, dead Death runes and blood runes. The quickest way to get there is going to be using the uh, Fairy Ring DKS. Uh, if you've unlocked the Fairy Rings, you can also use a player on house. Um, up in the top right corner, you can see the entrance. If you did Olaf's quest, you're familiar with it. Or you can just teleport to Ver or Camelot and walk all the way up if you want to. So if you're familiar with Olaf's quest, uh, you remember digging underneath this tree and you fall into this cave and you're going to find brine rats located just to the north. You're going to want to bring a good melee setup, uh, best melee setup that you have. Uh, I brought, you know, my fighter torso, dragon legs, berserker helm, um, dragon skimmy, and a DDS. And it worked out really well for me. You know, I got a you know, I did all 512 kills because I was trying to get a brine saber, um, but they're pretty easy to kill. It goes quick. I wanted kind of a different break from the normal combat uh, grind, and so I kind of went and did these. There's absolutely no competition out here. They're a great slayer task. Honestly, in my opinion, you make a little bit of money. Um, I highly recommend bringing bones to peaches because you can kind of do this whole thing in one trip. You know, if you want to go try and get the brine saber, or if you're doing them for a slayer task, bones to peaches allow you to do the whole thing all in one trip. Now they do drop unnoted uh, swordfish, which you can cook outside by Olaf in that infinite um, infinite fire that's out there. Now this is my 512th kill right here. I've been on a quest to try and get the brine saber, like I said, and I didn't get it. Didn't get the brine saber. 512 kills. Uh, it took me probably about two and a half, two and a half hours, maybe three hours. Um, and you can see here, uh, my enchanted gem kept the log for me, 512 kills. I ended up walking away with about 330k uh, worth of worth of loot. Had I gotten the Brian Saber, you know that would have bumped me up past 500k in about two and a half hours, two and a half three hours, which wouldn't have been bad. But I'm happy with 330k. You know, like I said, I, I wanted to kind of a break from the normal combat grind, um, and this was just kind of a fun Slayer task to go do. I had zero competition out here, zero competition. Uh, so I highly recommend Brian Rats if you just kind of need a break or if you want to go do something different uh, that really nobody else is doing. If you like these guides, if you want to see more of them, please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next Kutu Old School RuneScape Guide.